Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Hey, sorry about the background noise. Seems like every time I try to do a video, there's either a dog barking, somebody's doing their lawn, somebody's over there trimming their hedges right now. So sorry about the background noise. But today I wanted to go over my 2023 Evolution Pro 4 Pro. golf cart. I was gonna go over some of the features. I got the golf cart. Um, we do a lot of RV camping, so we take it to uh, campground, stuff like that. I don't even golf, honestly. Yeah, I just take it to campgrounds, drive around, drive it around the neighborhood here. It's a great little cart to have. Kind of fun to go get the mail with it, stuff like that. We take it to the store. It is street legal. I can drive on any road in California, as long as the posted speed limit's under 35 miles an hour. I can stay to the right and um, let cars go by. All right, let's go ahead and look at this uh, Evolution Pro 4. Okay guys, let's go over some of the features on this uh, Classic 4 Pro 4-seater made by Evolution. Measurements, if you guys care, I don't know, it's uh, 113 inches by 55 inches and 76 inches tall. That way you can get it into a trailer. I do know if you do put this in a cargo trailer, you have to get the extra tall version because the uh, the top, you know, it's pretty high up there. There's, it'd be impossible to take it off each time. I mean, you could do it, but it would be a pain to do that. It's got the 48 um, volt AC induction motor drive system, lithium battery. Let me show you the battery here real quick. Under the, under the seat here, oops, sorry, wrong way. Here's the lithium battery there. It's got onboard charger, so basically just plug it in. Use the standard 110 volt um, power cord, comes with it. Just plug it in right here. It shows you the charging status there. Also shows, shows you the charging status right here on the little gauge there too. I'll show you, I'll plug it in later and I'll show you how that works. It says it's got two tone seats, which means um, they're black and they have a yellow um, stitching in there, inlay. I don't know if you can change the color of that or not. This one just came that way. I kind of liked it, so I just left it. It's got uh, colored decorative wheel trim. It's got the Evolution logo right there in the center and also down here at the bottom. It's got a parking brake right here it does come with a stock stereo system in it as well and um, just has two speakers one here and one over there definitely can upgrade that put a sound bar in this thing it's also you got can really the, make a uh, dashboard with the color uh, matching cup holder insert it's also got a speedometer let me turn this on for you here real quick it's just keys key on and off right here it's got high and low function right here. So that I always keep it in low. Let's go about 12 miles an hour in low and it will do 25 miles an hour um, in the high speed position. All right, I'll see if I get better video of the actual speedometer once we get going here. All right, this does have the, um, the rear seat kit on it. So it does seat four. And if you want a little tray, you can flip this thing open here, this way. You can actually haul stuff in this thing. It's rated to hold about 100 pounds. So you can put propane tanks back there. It does have a little trunk back here, trunk storage space. We just have a little bag back here that we keep all the stuff in. I have the registration in here. It's got a cover, stuff like that. Pretty nice, kind of little hidden storage there. And you can fold the seat back up. Turn it back into the four seater. It's got rear foot rest here. Also has a golf bag holder that comes with it here. I actually have to take this off when we um, put it in the bed of my truck because it hits my propane tanks on my tra travel trailer. So I pull it off each time. Kind of a bummer. I'm gonna move the uh, license plate. License plate, I'm gonna move it down here. And it also comes with the rear camera right there. I'm gonna move that also. I'm gonna put the license plate here and put the rear camera underneath here somewhere. And then this, I'm just gonna get rid of all this bar right here. Cause I have to take it off each time anyway. All right, so this being a street legal model, it does have uh, full blinkers. See here, it does have a little horn. You just push the horn in here. Turn the headlights on, just go forward. They're on now, just shut them off. It's got full LEDs. Bluetooth capability, you can actually talk on your phone. There's a little microphone there. You can talk on your phone, play music. Let me show you the lights here. Turn on the headlights here. I actually went ahead and put side marker lights on it here. 
and I put one back here just because there's none on there. It does have LED tail lights and blinkers. Let me turn on the blinker for you. There's the blinker there. I don't know, it's kind of hard to see when um, people are sitting back there. So I actually installed a third brake light kit. I did that myself. It's up here. I don't know if you can see it flashing or not because I have the emergency brake on. We might have depressed the brake pedal. It actually flashes. Pretty bright, it's all LED. I don't know if you can see it flashing or not. You can also hook the turn signals up to that too and it lights up yellow. I haven't done that yet. I'm gonna do that for sure. All LED headlights. Super bright actually. And then I went ahead and added a, uh, a light bar here. Little 12 inch light bar. It actually lights up really well. Windshield does fold down. Pop these things down, folds down, hooks into here. I fold it down when I use it to, uh, when I trailer it, or if it's in the bed of my truck. It does have uh, USB charging ports here. Right here. You can see here, I'm at 37% here. Two functions, got the drive, neutral, and reverse. There's the high-low setting, and the key on and off. All right, what I do like about this cart, it does have the uh, acid dip powder coated steel chassis. Hot galvanized chassis is optional. If you do get the galvanized one, it is actually guaranteed for a lifetime warranty on the chassis. Got a 20 volt, 25 volt, I'm sorry, 25 volt uh, onboard waterproof evolution charger. I showed you that right next to the battery. It's programmed for lithium batteries. It shuts off when um, it reaches hundred uh, percent. It's got the clear foldable windshield. Optional golf bag holder, I got that. There's another kit you can buy with it too that holds the bags a little bit better. The bodies are made of uh, impact resistant uh, molded bodies, so they're pretty tough actually. Has independent suspension with the forearms. And they're built in Corona, California. That's where this one came from. Bright lighting front and rear for sure. Kind of keeps you safe on the road there. I figured I'd just show you guys a quick little uh, overview of it. So far, we really enjoy it. It's fun. Fun to take camping at the campground. It's fun to drive around, go get propane with it, drive it here in town, go get coffee at the... We have Old Town Clovis Coffee Shop. We take it down there. All right, guys. That is the, uh, the review on my 2023... Evolution Pro 4 golf cart. Hope you guys like it. The rest of the video, I'm just gonna do drive it around. We'll take it for a little cruise. Oh, I forgot to mention too, it does have cup holders for the back seat passengers as well and a cell phone holder. So that's kind of cool. All right, guys, let's take this thing out for a cruise. It'd be kind of fun. We'll just take it around the neighborhood. Maybe we can find some more people mowing their lawn, running chainsaws and stuff like that while we uh, make the video. <laughs> All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it. Go ahead and like the video. Comment, too, if you like. Let me know what you think about it or if you have one. And remember, if you subscribe to me, I'll definitely subscribe right back to you. All right, guys. Thanks again so much for watching. I appreciate it. Let's go out and take this thing for a ride.